I don't have a crystal ball. I don't have any idea whether it's 300 or 400 or whatever. Uh, so it's, it's difficult. But certainly, uh, these bonds are in the bank's portfolios. If they lose value, they are denting into the capital position of the banks. We don't see such a risk. The, and, and this links with the, what, uh, with the previous question about central bank independence. Central bank independence is predicated on monetary dominance, not on fiscal dominance. And uh, to finance government deficits is not part of our mandate. Our mandate is price stability. So that is the – of course, we have, as you will remember from the previous crisis, we have OMT as a specific instrument. But uh, uh, other than that, we have uh, – we, uh, we are in a regime of monetary dominance. What can one do uh, as far as banks are concerned – uh, given the, the widening of the spreads that taken place, that has taken place uh, in the last five, six months. And um, I think there are – the first answers – maybe, I mean, there may be other answers, but the first answer come to mind is, first of all, reduce the tone and, uh, and uh, don't question the constitutional existential framework of the euro – and the second is reduce the spreads. So uh, do policies that lead to a reduction in the spreads.